Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is Tyler Putnam 2.0 and today in this video I'm going to be getting my new phone. We're going to be meeting up halfway downstate to meet up with my sister because unfortunately I was trying to purchase my phone and every time I would try to buy it they would cancel the order and I tried to buy it four different ways and every single time they canceled my order, they red flagged our address and I wasn't able to even purchase it anymore. So what ended up happening was I tried so hard and I eventually got my money back and then we put the money in my sister's account and she was able to order the phone. But then the whole coronavirus happened and I had to wait like a month or so until today so that we could actually go and meet up and uh, me get my phone. And I also, in that time span, I had her or, uh, get me a new phone case for it as well, and it should be awesome. I bought this phone so that I would have it for TikTok, so that I had a nice new camera, a nice new setup to work on my TikTok stuff, and you know, just have a nice new phone to use. This vlog, we are gonna go downstate, halfway. I live in Michigan. We're gonna meet up halfway with my sister, see what's up, uh, try to stay our distance because it's a whole coronavirus, but I'm getting my new phone today. It's gonna be hype. I'm gonna do a little unboxing video at the end and show you guys the phone. It's gonna be awesome. So hopefully you guys enjoy the video and I will see you guys in a moment. Hey Dad, what's up? Hey. Are you are you happy today? Oh, I'm real happy. It's a nice day out, actually. Yeah, it is pretty nice. It just sucks that the coronavirus is going on, right? What do you think about the coronavirus? Yeah, I don't think much about it. What's your thoughts about it? Like, oh, it definitely sucks, right? Yeah, it's terrible. But I guess we're already conditioned to staying at home 24/7, right? Yeah. <laughs> you don't get out much. Yeah, I don't. Because nobody wants to hang out. We're actually 10 miles from nobody. <laughs> <laughs> so so we're actually good. We're like in the middle of nowhere. But it's not all that bad. And today is a nice day. So uh, I guess let's go. Hey, what's up? We are on our way. All right, remember to wash your hands and bring your mask. Yeah. Yeah, and we have to stay like in our cars, okay? Okay. So you'll have All to right, you you'll have to throw the phone to me somehow. Remember? All right, I'll see yeah, you okay. Lot. All right, we'll see you. All right, we're now on our way downstate, but we had to stop at the uh, gas station so I could get a drink because it's actually a really nice day out and it's really hot. It is warm, yeah. It's yeah. 61 right now. It's not, it's not been this warm in a while. I mean, it still feels kind of cold, but it definitely feels a lot warmer. So uh, I guess I will pick up this vlog once we get down there because there's n I don't have a lot of uh, other stuff to talk about at the moment. And uh, I guess if we see anything cool, I'll uh, pop out the camera, but I don't think that's gonna happen. It's just one long, boring ride, so I will see you there. All right, so I'm sorry if you guys hear any uh, like noises in the back. My dad's being loud. But uh, we have currently arrived to the KFC where we are going to meet up with my sister. So we don't know if she's here exactly, but uh, where are you going to Burger King? We go to KFC. Now I gotta turn around. <laughs> but yeah, we don't know if she's exactly here right now, but uh, you know, whatever. We'll just wait for her and we're going to get my new phone. So uh, yeah, I don't think she's over there. I mean, we checked over there last time she wasn't she would probably be in this area and she is not here yet i don't exactly know what car she has i think it's a silver equinox an equinox like us oh wait yeah okay that's not her well when she gets here i will pick up the camera hopefully she gets here soon so we're not sitting here in the sun because it is hot don't forget to wear your masks gotta stay safe from this virus guys 
So we're currently still waiting for my sister. Unfortunately, the lobby's closed, but I guess you can go in and get to-go orders. So you probably have to call. But uh, hey, is that Ashley right there? Yeah. I think that's her in that car. Yeah. Right there. Yeah. Her cat was on my For You page. Hello. They probably can't see you, but you got my phone? I do. Oh, yes. You'll have to throw it to me. No, it's over $1,200 in here. All right, sweet. New There's phone. There's a puzzle in there, too. There's a puzzle? Yeah, mom said you didn't have any puzzles, so right, cool. I already did that one. Okay. All right. All right, so uh, bye, I bye. guess. Uh, see you in a couple <laughs> years. Don't cough on me. Oh, my God. What'd you get? You got some, uh, Don't my car is so food. dirty. <laughs> All right, well, we got the new phone. Let's go. All right, so we got my phone and my phone case. This is gonna be awesome. That is right there, and when we get back home, um, we're gonna, you know, visit with my sister here for a moment. But when we get back home, I'm gonna do a little unboxing video, take a look at the phone, my phone case, and all that. So it should be cool. I think I'm gonna open it right now, but then I'll package it back up and like open it later for you guys. So, you know, yeah. If you guys are enjoying the vlog, I know it's not much, but definitely leave a like down below and a comment. Ashley, did you download TikTok? What was that? I can't hear you. Yeah. You did? Everyone go follow my sister's TikTok. I'll have a screenshot of it right here. So if you got TikTok, definitely go follow Ashley. All right, we are now in my room, and I am out of breath because I've been running up and down the stairs trying to gather all the things for this video. Um, this is the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. So I did put it back in the box, unfortunately, but it's not like a true unboxing video, I'm sorry. But uh, I don't want it to fall out when I open it. All right. Definitely nice, and I got it in the blue color, as you guys see here. Now typically I get these phones in black, because that's just what I do, I'm basic. So like my last phone, it was just a black phone, all black. So this is my Galaxy S8 Plus, and I've had this for like two or three years now, probably even longer, but it's been holding up really well, and I've got a lot of stuff done and accomplished with this phone. I now have over 300,000 followers on TikTok. I did it all with this phone. It's been running like a beast ever since I got it, and it works good and does what I want it to. You're probably thinking, then why'd you just spend all this money on a new phone? I just wanted something new. I've had it for so long, and I wanted to try out a Note. Now, it's not all bad. I won this money, and I was able to buy this phone. But then this coronavirus thing came along, and we all got a stimulus check of like $1,000 or $1,200. It pretty much paid for the phone. So, yeah, besides that, this is uh, my new Galaxy Note 10, and uh, I'm gonna show you guys some of the other things. Now, this phone, compared to my last phone, it doesn't have a headphone jack. And now, typically, I've always had a headphone jack, and I know that iPhone uh, got rid of that headphone jack, and they did something like this. They give you a pair of headphones, but, you have to plug it into the slot where you uh, charge at, so the charging slot. Or they're forcing you basically to buy their wireless earbuds, which I already have. I have the Galaxy Buds, which are nice, so I'll definitely have to put those to use now that I got this phone. They gave me a super fast charging charger for the phone. So you got this, and it's actually, instead of USB to USB-C, or whatever it's called, it's USB-C to USB-C. So that's gonna be really quick, so you just plug it in there, 
plug it into your phone. That's gonna be a really nice quick, you know, charge. That's gonna be awesome. I don't know much else to show you. I guess, uh, let me see what else is in the box that I didn't get out. Okay, there's something in here. All right, these came with my last phone. So it's a USB to a USB, or a, a USB-C to USB. So I could plug this into the phone and maybe plug in like a USB drive or like a mouse or something like that. So that's nice to have. They make these hard to get into, like, what are you hiding? All right, so, okay. I've never had a Note phone before, so this is all new to me. So this phone has a stylus built in, just like so, and they give you a tool which you can use to take out the tip of the, uh, the, the stylus if it gets worn down over time. And they give you two new tips for it, a white and a black one. So they give you a little tool to remove the tip once it gets uh, worn down after using it so much. I'm trying to be careful with this thing, it's so fragile, but uh, let me see if there's maybe something hiding in here. Probably not, I don't know if I can even get this open. Yeah, okay, I think that's like glued in. So I don't think there's anything in there, but there is something here. All right, so this is for the SIM card, of course, on the back there. And then, um, all right, Samsung. This device is packaged with a screen protector. If you remove it and want to use a different screen protector, make sure it allows for use of all touchscreen features. Yeah, and I noticed that it actually uh, already has a screen protector which is very nice, and uh, it's actually put on there very nice. Doesn't have any bubbles or anything, so, like me trying to put a screen protector on, you might get a bunch of bubbles in the screen or whatnot. Well, I, I didn't use a screen protector on my S8 Plus, but typically I use a tempered glass screen protector. It's very nice that they put a screen protector on this because it is an expensive phone. And then there's a quick reference guide as well, which I will probably take a look at, but who, look, who really looks at these things? <laughs> they just like throw them to the side, call it good. You know, it's just a phone. I know everything about phones because it's the only thing I ever do. Okay, transfer what's important. Okay, so you plug it into your old device and then you can use this connector to uh, put things from your old phone into your new one. So I don't know if I'll do any of that. I kind of just like to start off in a fresh slate and I'll still have this phone around to like look at photos and stuff that may have been on it because it still works really good. I also went to Walmart before we came home and I got the Keep Your Own Phone uh, Straight Talk kit so that I could get it all set up and get my, uh, my phone switched over to the new one. And then I guess the last thing that I gotta show you is my nice new case. So I went with this like clear background, but it actually has a camo design. And I thought that would look cool with the, uh, the blue kind of shining in through. So I'm gonna put the case on. Kinda give you a look at what, and I noticed it's actually really easy to take off and on. It just slips right on and slips right off. Now with this case that I have on this phone, oh my god, it's such a pain. So uh, here's the phone with the case on, and as you guys can see, that nice blue color shining through with the camo looks really cool. It's definitely a nice and big phone, and compared to this phone, this one has more of a square design, and this one has rounded edges, basically. So I definitely kind of like this design a lot better, and uh, I cannot wait to hop in and get this all set up. You know, I have to go figure out how to set up my phone. I already called Straight Talk and uh, figured out what SIM card to use from this little kit. I have to use the AT&T one. So I guess I'm gonna call Straight Talk, get my phone all set up. This has been my vlog. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I got a lot of other videos coming to the page. Definitely, if you guys have enjoyed this video, please go smash that like button. If you are new, please consider subscribing and I will hope to see you guys in my next video. We are on our way to 5,000 subscribers. We're at around 3,500 plus, so I'm hoping that we can hit our goal, you know, by the end of the year or something. I just wanna keep on going, keep on trying my best. We're definitely doing good on TikTok, and if you are from TikTok and you're watching this video, what is up? Definitely leave a comment down below if you are. So I just got done recording this video a couple days ago, and I've been using my phone for a little while now, and it's a great phone.
But the whole reason I bought it was to have a nice new phone for TikTok because I've been doing very well on TikTok. And uh, when I go to use the camera through the TikTok app, it does not look good. I think I might be making another video talking about that and what I'm going to do. So I guess stay tuned. I'm a little frustrated, but I'll definitely still get a lot of use out of the Note 10 Plus, and I still really do like it. It's just the fact that the camera is not working with TikTok that well, and I really need it to. So I might make a video about that. Stay tuned. Thank you guys for watching. Ugh.